To make a court booking, click on your court booking tab up at the top and then court bookings in the top left corner. This will launch your court booking screen which you have the option of viewing by court type or instructor and then further to that viewing the individual instructor or the individual court type if you have multiple. To make a booking, double click on the court, instructor and time that you wish to make the booking for and it will open up your booking screen. The first thing you'll be asked for is a booking source. Then the booking type, which you might have multiple. Keep in mind if you do pick certain booking types, such as lessons, you might be required to select an instructor down below. The booking date should already be selected, and down below you can assign the member. So you can choose from your list of members by clicking these three little dots, or you can key in the member's code here. More information about that member will pop up, and if you keep moving down the screen, booking details will appear. So you have a start time and an end time, as well as a duration, and the court that this is happening on. You can also assign an instructor. If you've chosen certain booking types, again, you may have to choose an instructor no matter what. You can add a booking note in this section here, and you can also add any rental equipment this member might need. So by adding rental equipment, you'll see the charge appear in this POS items for booking summary. You can hit client info and it will show you more information about the client that's on the booking, including their address and contact info and any preferences they might have. So preferences can be the court type, the gender of the instructor, the individual instructor, or pre preferred facilities. You can add in extra info about this member or any notes to display internally upon check-in health information, booking, and also just check-in information, which you can choose to display at certain points of this appointment. Client history will show you previous bookings for this member. A booking log will show you edits to this booking, so who's canceled or moved the booking to other courts. And reminders will give you a reminder schedule if you do have reminder emails booked to go out for your members. Hitting save and close will save this booking and close it. Hitting save and copy will save this booking and copy it to another day. You also have options to delete the booking, cancel the booking, mark this person as a no-show, check them in or uncheck them in if you've clicked check in by accident. And further to that, once they're here and ready to pay, you can assign the charges to the members or guests in the booking and then launch POS to actually bill them.